Hello friends, now in this video we start making the this W3 school clone website all this one by one you get a daily one video for this one component and in this video we first of all make a this top section see this top section and this website we make a responsive also let's first of all in this video we make a this top section see this one and this website we this now where we also make a responsive in next studio let's start it first of all make this top section go on the vs code editor and here first of all we make a one file index.html and this is a mail file here first of all html boilerplate for that press the shift and exclamatory mark enter all this boilerplate is automatically generated now here you can see in the w skill school here you can see first of all here in the top section we have a this logo and this title for that let's uh, first of all i want to run this with uh, open live server with a G, uh, vs code extension automatically re-render this all the html code if we will change and you can install from the this vs code extension option here just type the live server and here you get this one and you can install this automatically this this option will be open now first of all let's change the this title first uh, for here we want to this icon for that uh, you can right click and go on the inspect or we can right click directly here and inspect here you can see this types of icon is automatically rotated but i want to in the this title icon little bit small to go on the top section here you could find the this header head and expand this header here you can see that this title let me just copy this title and paste in your code after that we want to include this icon uh, you can see here our vs code it here browser uh, title will be changed now i want to also give the icon for that here let's uh, search some uh, icon link uh, let me see here is a favicon icon but let me just copy this and check if available from ok w3 school icon ok and just remove this now you can see this icon just copy this url and go on the your vs code editor here just uh, use the link tag after that give the rel and icon this will be icon and give the reference of link of the that icon and now let's close this tag now let's uh, see in your browser this icon will be display now let's uh, see close this now first of all we want to make uh, like this types of your whole things for that uh, i want to let's go on here and here we want to create one uh, header and here I just commented or also ok and inside that you can see we have a two column this uh, left section and this right section for that uh, we create a two div tag here div and giving the using the vs code emit div and giving enter after that automatically this created now inside the header we have a two div tag in first div tag you can see we have a this logo and this tutorial and this navigation menu and in the right side we have a this types of a logo and this button first of all we make the, this left section after we go on the right section for that uh, first of all i want to add the this types of icon right click here go on the inspect section and here you can find the this icon link uh, let me just see 
okay this is in the form of a this icon is somewhere already included let me just see let me just search on the font awesome yeah, type on the browser font awesome and here click search here type w3 school let me see school logo is available yeah not available here uh, for that i can search on the google w3 school logo after that uh, this logo will be display right click here and you can directly copy this link address copy link address and go on the your vs code editor here we create another div tag and giving the class name will be logo and here you can give the w3 uh, school logo and inside that we use the img after that esrc and paste the this U url you will copy from the browser after that here close this img tag and let's go on the your browser here you can see yeah this uh, logo is not display let me just uh, copy this copy image address and paste here yeah this i think i was copy some other link let me just check and just replace this yeah now let me see yeah see in the browser here see this type of logo is now populated now i want to make this uh, width and height instance design i want to for that i want to make a one css file for the designing purpose here i give the style dot css and this file i want to link with the html file to go on the your head section in the top and here just give the link rel and style sheet after that give the path of the your style sheet uh, my style sheet in the same path where index dot html file for that directly i give the style dot css and here I want to close this tag now this tag will be linked for the checking purpose you can uh, give the body color will be red let me just check yeah, ok back uh, sorry background color red and see this background color is changed now we want to first of all make uh, this types of a height uh, approximately this one for that uh, let me come here and just uh, this header one and here you can see by default uh, this uh, HTML body will be head is margin and padding we first of all remove this margin 0 and also giving the uh, padding also we give the 0 now this zero now you can see this automatically full screen now here i was just copy this header one come in the style.css here header and give the header height will be approximately give the 50 pixel and give the background color will be some other for the checking purpose how much width will here you can see this height will be smaller as compared to original one let me just increase this height we get the 80 pixel uh, little bit more we give 70 yeah no no 75 little bit I think uh, up down yeah now ok proper uh, 
okay let me just i think i was closed shift control and t uh, the recent tab you are closed that will be automatically open and now this side will be set first of all we want to give the logo and uh, for that here i was already created a uh, this uh, w3 school logo just copy this one and come in the style.css here i comment here uh, logo section w3 school logo css code and uh, you can refer here and let me just paste the class name and give the logo width will be approximately we give the 100 pixel width and height will be automatically and here i give the in the w3 school w3 school logo inside that we have uh, this image tag we want to also give this this img and give the width will be 100 pixel 100 uh, percent its parent now you can see here w3 logo is here and but this logo is little bit more small as compared to how our section for that we reduce this height will width will be approximately 80 pixel of 50 yeah now you can see this logo is almost similar to this one and here i want to make uh, all this content will be in the center not up and down for here a header we have uh, given the width uh, will be 100 percent and we give the padding will be approximately we make a uh, padding is necessary let me just check for now it's okay and here we give the padding will be we want to give padding from the this left side and right side for the top and bottom we give the 0 pixel and left right we give the 10 pixel let me just check here little bit space is coming we want to give more you can give it as per the here and uh, here we want to give ok and we want to this logo in the center for here i can directly give the display flex and alignment item will be center now see this logo will in the center and this logo i think little bit big let me just give the small 45 and here i want also give the padding will be uh, margin approximately one pixel now let me check yeah here and here this little bit uh, not a proper place this will be outside and this will be inside uh, i think i want to give more padding here I can give the margin will be 2 pixel let me just check a uh, little bit we give the 3 pixel yeah little bit here give 25 pixel now you can see uh, this logo will be same place not be changing and uh, now let me just uh, remove this background color and give the this background color just right click here go, ins go on the inspect section and we want to color code of this top section for that uh, let me just check anywhere yeah this top section is white color for that we can directly give the here background color will be white 
and here see this automatically generate a white but I want to design for the designing purpose uh, here just give the background color will be little bit not a uh, white but uh, little bit gray type after the design will be completed we again change this in the form of a white now here uh, just now we want to create this three tutorial section this menu for that uh, and we want to also give this logo see when we click on the this logo it will be automatically redirect to this w3 school as like this one we want to also make a here link for that we can directly give the uh, here and here we use the anchor tag after that h reference or we can directly give the in the outside here a ref and path of that after that here just cut this close navbar uh, anchor tag and press the paste shift alt f for the formatting purpose now let me see yeah little bit up down uh, for that up down we want to give here i was giving some margin let me just uh, give the zero pixel now let me see yeah here you can see little bit up uh, now it's uh, here I think I was give one pixel yeah here now it's okay zero pixel and uh, now we want to make this for that come in the here and uh, this in the left section okay and here I want to this one is a first one here I want to create a another and this title name will be tutorial and here I want to make this menu will do in the this is a temporary one we will change it don't worry and here inside this we want to make a this list see if I was clicking here this box will be open but this box will be created in the next video in this video just this one here I want to make uh, another view or directly we use the P -L -L -I tag and we give the tutorial and we want to also add this uh, icon this icon uh, for that I use the CDNJ font awesome for this icon for that go on the font awesome let me just type font awesome and here just close this one and click on the search here type the caret and enter now here you can see this type of icon is as here and here just cop click here and this copy this class name and come in the your file HTML file and paste is here now here you can see logo is not looking in the br your browser for that we want to also add the this uh, library this script file you can go on the this start button and here click here uh, enter your email ID after that send to kit this font awesome will be sent to you some script file but in this video we use the cdnj for that go on the browser and here type the font or we can type a cdnj cdnj.com library font awesome and here go version is 6.2.1 and assist type all here you can directly click copy link tag and go on your browser in the top section header section head section and here just uh, comment this 
and give the font awesome and paste here after that uh, go on the browser and see icon will be display go here and here here you can see find this types of a icon and here where is here you can uh, no need of a you can also if you want to use the li tag okay if you don't want to use the li tag then also just remove this only like this then you can see our tags will be displayed like this also for that uh, now i want to add uh, like this one uh, this uh, two more just copy this one and paste one by one and here i want to add the reference here just change this url reference here to give the reference and here third will be exercise what is this exercises and here also exercises and after that i want to add the this video section here come and here give the anchor tag after that h reference and this will be the video and here we can give the video now here you can see in browser this all menu will be display here now here i want to all this tag in the center and this font will be little bit big uh, for that we can do here and uh, this is a div tag and here we can give the class name will be header left give the header left and another div tag we give the header right and just copy this header le left class name and inside the header left you can see we have a this anchor tag and just copy this header left and come in the your style.css file and here i commented uh, just uh, header left uh, this part will be header left for the your referencing purpose and here put this class after that here i want to give the display flags and here you can see all this i in the single row now i want to give this all in the center here use the alignment item center now see all this icon will be in the center and here you can see this types of a we want to give for that here we give the height will be 100 percent for the checking purpose how much this height will be taken we give the background color red let me just see yeah here you can see automatically this full height <coughs> but we want to give this height it uh, this background color also uh, for that inside the header left we have a this anchor tag let me just come here and here header left we have a anchor tag and here I want to give the background color red now you can see this all we automatically come but uh, this see this will be not taking the full height uh, here I want to give the height will be 100% yeah now see all this icon will go on the above side uh, here we i want to give display flags and alignment item center now you can see content will be in the center uh, for the hovering effect we want to check if we our cursor will be in any of the text then this color will be j look for that here we can give the header left after that this anchor tag and give the hover then after that just cut this background color here and here paste is here 
now you can see when we uh, our cursor will be any of the text then this background color will be display now I want to give the, this little bit space also uh, here see in the logo section this uh, also looking but we don't want to give the this background color also this one we can directly come here and here give the in the header left uh, we have a this and nth child or we can give the first child how our effect will be background color will be transparent yeah now you can see if when I hover on the image this logo no color will be changed and here we give the 50 pixel let's change this logo is 50 pixel and remove this uh, margin and add the padding will be approximately uh, top and bottom section will be 0 pixel or you can directly give the 10 pixel let me just check yeah you can see this image will really looking big and uh, for that we can do here give the 20 pixel okay just remove this and give the 48 and our image will be fine yeah and our image will be slide this left one but we don't want to slide we want to give this uh, 10 pixel now let me just check yeah here you can see little bit more and this will be go on the top section for that we give the top will be 0 pixel margin uh, sorry padding and here you can see our logo will be little bit big and slide and here we want to just give the padding will be 20 pixel it more slide uh, we can give the 7 pixel five now logo will be a little bit these are coming little bit up and these are down uh, we can do here and also left right yeah can just give the 5.5 just give the 4 here I want to give 20 pixel after that here just increase this 10 pixel and 7 yeah now see these are ok and our image will be little bit this side we give the 8 pixel little bit go up <laughs> now you can see our logo will be proper in the place and little bit up and down for now it's okay and here we want to now make this uh, tutorial for that to come here and here give the various anchor tag here I want to give the padding from the left and right will be approximately top and bottom 0 and let me just give the left right will be 10 pixel now let me just check 
uh, if we give the anything from this anchor tag also apply on the this one uh, for that I want to just give here padding will be 0 uh, in the anchor tag and yeah uh, okay we we are hover then okay just cut here and paste here now yeah when I was hover this uh, padding little bit come okay okay I was also make this uh, not hover here I want to just give the cut this here and paste here and yeah now it will be sticky and I want to give the little bit more uh, this font uh, for that here I come and give the font size will be 18 pixel let me just check and uh, yeah and this font it uh, let me just copy this inspect and go on the check the font family I want to check the which font family this just come here and this is a uh, Antana let me just uh, copy this you name and go on the Google font let me just check this font is available from the Google or not and come here and paste this name ah, okay this font is not available let me just use the pop-ins yeah this font is here and uh, I want to just remove yeah already added this for pins we can do directly click here and copy this all these things and go on your browser index.html file we can ha add in the head section uh, here we give the comment google font family and here paste this after that uh, press the con shift alt f uh, for the formatting purpose and now you can see our this will be change and now I want to add that this pop in will be in the our where is just co copy this family name and come in the style.css and in the body section and here paste this now let me see ok you can see our text will be yeah we can also sans sorry pro let me just copy this let me see in the google font may be available and here yeah I think this font is uh, just remove this all and uh, just select this one all this we want to according to the requirement we use all this and uh, here this 9 and now again copy this come in the index.html and here I give the font family which will be opens and after that here again we want to add the uh, this uh, sorry here I was write the good let me just write the google google font family uh, I think this is a let me just paste this code and press con shift alt f for the formatting purpose and here just write the source sans pro and uh, I want to add this copy this family name font family name and come in the style.css 
uh, remove this one and paste here now let me just check yeah now this one is coming and uh, I want to make uh, all this font will be little bit bold for that we can give the font weight will be 500 Yeah, you can do this, and uh, I think bold will be approximately 600, not a 500 is not available. We can give the 600. Let me just see. Yeah, now font will be look bold, and here. and now I want to give the little bit more padding uh, for that we give the this 15 pixel ok give 20 ok now this will be look good and here we want to change the, this background color we give the sorry font font color for that we give the background font color will be black and now here we can see okay and we want to remove this underline text decoration none yeah and we want to little bit space from the this uh, icon and for that uh, we can do one thing <coughs> here you can see the fast solid uh, this class name fast solid and come in the your style.css file uh, in the header section here we can directly add here fast solid and here we can give the padding uh, 0 pixel from the top and bottom side and we give the 5 pixel from the left and right now here you can see little bit space is coming but this is space is too much we give the 3 pixel and here you can see this is a tutorials and let me just add here yes yeah now see this will look good and uh, now I want to remove this background color and go on here and where is in the top section just give this white yeah now see and this hover effect also I want to change this right click go on the inspect and let me just search the background color when I was hover mm. click here we can directly go on uh, some other page or just select this icon and come here and after that let me just search what is the background color ok we have uh, this multiple color and just uh, copy this to variable name and uh, come in the your in the about the body we can create uh, this uh, root for that uh, we create a root and after that so paste this and we want to use this uh, green color or bs green let me just here i give the background color will be variable where and this will be b. let me just cut this and cut here come here and here you can see ok this color is not a uh, proper or we want to also change the color will be white text color will be white and yeah this color will be little bit uh, light and this will be dark let me just give this yeah tail one no 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 not this color let me just go on again and then cursor will be placed here and just copy this background color is this one and come in the top section 
पेस्ट हीयर एंड आ चेक मी चेंज आल्सो हीयर या आई थिंक नाउ दिस वन इज ओके फॉर दिस हीयर यू कैन सी now this color will be proper as compared to this one and here little bit up and down why our okay our this icon up and down little bit or that we can go here just mm padding will be very spreading yeah here we can give the 19 pixel let me just see now our this icon see this icon is little bit up and down we want to center this icon uh, for that this is a fast solid and <coughs> here we can uh, no no somewhere let me just see this is a here and here i want to give the this will be align item and i was no, not giving the justify content center yeah this icon we will it you to go okay justify item will be also center yeah now see our icon will be also in the center now this much is uh, done and here this icon little bit more i think this will be 20 uh, we want to give this margin from the this logo for that uh, here come here i want to give margin right will be approximately 5 5 pixel let me just see yeah now see it's okay uh this uh, right part will uh, this left part will be done and now we go on the this uh, right part first of all here you can see we have a this i this uh, button uh, we can directly create here one class utility class for the btn and in the top section uh, here or is in some here i create uh, in the top section let me just give the utility utility class and here i give the btn uh we give the btn has a by default padding uh 5 pixel and 10 pixel from the left and right and now something yeah we can give the 10 pixel from the both side yeah 10 pixel from the both hand side and uh, okay now this much done and let's uh, create this all btn <coughs> this is a header left and go on the header right 
and here first of all I want to add uh, this types of uh, icon this dark mode and light mode here I create a div and giving the class name will be uh, Rogal light and dark enter inside that I want to add uh, this icon for that I can give the let me just search in the font or some this types of uh, icon is available or not click on the, this search and here I can search uh, dark press enter and here you find uh, this types of a uh, circle copy this and come in the your code paste in the here and you can see on the here this types of icon is now coming and uh, I think this will be the left one let me just come here and here I can find uh, let me click if I was clicking ok this color will be rotate uh, for that we can directly give this uh, Rogal class copy this uh, and come here uh, here I give the comment uh, here all the class of style of the is header right section and here just paste this Rogal and I want to give the transform uh, trans uh, rotate 180 degree now let me just see now you can see our icon will be rotated and uh, I want to change this color uh, when see when I was hover this color will be changed as like this one we can give here rogal light and dark mode when I was hover this color will be and green type let me or we can give the this background color will be green uh, let me see if I use our see this color will be changed and this color will be in the form of a pointer we can give in the our utility class in the btn section here I give the cursor pointer now you can see yeah why this is not coming sorry I was not added this class name in this just copy this class and add here and now let me see yeah now see this is coming and uh, now I want to add uh, this icon global let me just search this global icon or we can type uh, global something like this types of uh, icon let me just see uh, this is a uh, world any world icon yeah this icon this types of a ok we can add uh, which one this one is a uh, white and space I think this one uh, just click on the, this free version and uh, here we can add uh, this earth europe one uh, and copy this class name and again I want to create a, uh, another class let me see what is feature of this section hover and I was clicking ok translate here I want to give the toggle trans translate and here I want to give paste this after that uh, let me just see on my browser here you can find this icon now next icon will be search uh, I was already remember the search class name just give the drag class name toggle search here I can give the little bit is underscore for the reading purpose uh, fast solid 
far let me see and I think that this class name or something other yeah I think I want to check yeah click first yeah okay magnifying glass okay sorry here I want to paste again now yeah now search icon which coming again I want to this uh, four button for that uh, here this all the I think I want to all these are in the form of a link if I was clicking see okay this types of a okay this is not a link here I want to click this also not a link but this three upgrade yeah if, even I click on this upgrade and this get certificate and the free website and login all these are going on another page for that uh, let's uh, create this all the link and here I create a, a H reference and here I want to give this closing anchor tag and here I want to give the this will be upgrade and here I want to give tax will be upgrade and another will be anchor tag and this will be get certificate uh, what is certi get certified sorry and get certified okay now our next will be option will be let me just free website uh, here I can give the free website and after that our last is a login and here I give the login and here is space now let me just close this one and here go now you can see this all things are coming now I want to all this first of all I want to uh, design this all for that we can do here uh, add one class uh, everywhere and here I do add uh, just uh, press the alt and click he all this for link and uh, here I give the class btn now here you can see little bit space is automatically coming and uh, with things one two three and this space website and we can add uh, one more class and uh, btn modifier or we can give the btn link after that we can add a separate class everyone uh, this one is a I think I want to add a only all this background color see here this black color and this is a pink this is yellow and this is green for that we can directly add a here one another class uh, for that we can give the uh, BG uh, black and this will be get static but we will be BG pink and here I give the P BG what is a free website yellow and this will be BG green uh, I think this is uh, in the same and now I want to just first of all copy this uh, one by one first of all we give the this background all this color uh, for that uh, here I was already make uh, this utility class 
comment here and here first of all add the bg black for i want to all this color proper name just click here and go on the inspect section and here go on the bottom section uh, where is variable all this variable and here and here in the bottom section let me just search uh, all this color name for checking let me just uh, ok variable name is where btn and ok this variable name you uh, can do anywhere be mm, just give here and go on the bottom section here I want to give select this tag and come here and here you can find uh, this color I want to variable name ok somewhere variable name is not available let me just copy one by one this color name ok this is a black color just copy this color code name and come in the top section here I want to make uh, one bs black and here i want to give this color and let me just uh, uh, another color here important this one copy this and here i want to give bs and this will be pink after that uh, just select this and paste come here and this yellow color and here give the bs yellow after that paste this now i want to last this color just come here and here i was already added just uh, checking for this here you can 04 aa 60 04 aa 80 now here already added only i want to put this all here give the background color this uh, will be variable uh, black after that I want to give the pink and here give the background color will be where this will be pink after that uh, bg yellow and background color will be uh, where this yellow after the last section will be bg green and here i can give the bg and this will be green background color will be uh, bare and green now let me just uh, close this and come in our section here you can see our tax color will be changed now here uh, we want to also change the this color also for that we can go on the bottom section and here you can see when the we give the black color then this color will uh, tax color will be always white and here now yeah and every time this bg color will be not a uh, this black color sometimes it will be white or sometimes some other color like this types of you can see 
and here every time you can see find when the background color will be green then text color will be white here I want to also give the color will be white and when the pink and other color then you can find the text color will be black like that I want to give here color will be black where and we give the very black here and just copy this here and paste it here and uh, change here I want to also give the BS white and this color will be and let me just copy this uh, because I want to add the th all this variable everywhere and for that I can directly add bg white and uh, somewhere here I want to give the white and also here now you can see our text color will be changed now we want to make this all and uh, I'm in the bottom section here you can let me just go on here and this header left just copy this header left and come in the style.css here first of all all this content will be in the single row we can give the directly display flags now this and all this uh, item will be center we can give the alignment item will be center yeah and I want to let's uh, all these are coming now we can do here all this content will be come in the left side for that we can give the justify item will be flex end sorry flex end now ok and this width will be not be covering that's why I think some this header right section some other tag maybe to check no no in the header right section no another tag then why these are not happening okay just okay justify here justify content will be flex end yeah now see all this content will be come here and this overflow we can do here in the body section we can give the width is 100 pixel and all this tag uh, by default has a, its own padding and margin we can remove by here giving the universal selector and box sizing border box now see all these are gone and these are ok and our logo will be see little bit uh, small we want to make this logo properly for that uh, again I want to remove the only let me see here I was uh, first of all just uh, make this padding comment now you can see my logo and yeah now I want to only little bit slight little I want to logo will be little bit slight uh, we can do here one thing uh, we can just uh, remove the padding our logo will be more coming let me just uh, uncomment this after that I want to make uh, margin from the left side or we can give the little bit ok we can give the this width will be 50 pixel and now we can
scan q0 and now let me see ok and this will be 5 Yeah, now it's okay and only I want to engage this width will be 60 yeah now it's fine and now here I want to make uh, this all this here you can see little bit space everywhere this gap uh, for that we can directly give in the this header right we can give the gap will be 5 pixel let me just see ok this will be not 10 pixel ok this will be not 20 no, this will be 15 yeah now it's uh, almost uh, ok now I want to make design this all uh, inside the header right here you can find uh, all this anchor tag uh, for that we can do here header right and inside that we have an anchor tag here this anchor tag I want to make this and this will be padding from the left and right and also first of all we make we give the font we give the font will be approx 18 pixel and uh, this font uh, weight will be 600 yeah and this underline will be want to remove text decoration none and this border radius will be approximately 60 pixel yeah this will be automatically coming and here we can give the padding uh, see if this padding is not a proper we can go on the our btn section we can include top side top and this will be 20 pixel mm, I think this will be by default is ok because here also disturb here <coughs> padding uh, top side will be 10 pixel and left right will be give 20 pixel now let's see and yeah now you can see all the icon will be proper but I want to only engage the this login one and here for that we can give here header uh, we can give the header right and nth last child we can give the last child and here we can give the padding will be this padding will be approximately 
30 pixel let me just see or we can give the p okay just increase this 55 now you can see our this uh, top section will be now look good and here I was uh, okay now it's okay and here I was not giving the videos come here and here I want to change uh, videos yeah now you can see our this top section and this top section this w3 now but top section it will exactly same <coughs> and uh, here you can see when I was hover this back background color will be changed I was already doing here when I was hover this background color will be changed and here also you can see when I hover this background color will be not be changed but here little bit uh, this background color will be changed for that we can do one thing here in the let me just first of all uh, of the night mode and here I want to come and this is anchor tag just uh, we can do all things here also <coughs> here this anchor tag just copy this and come here we can give hover effect and inside that uh, we can give the background or we can give the let me just give opacity 0 0.8 let me just check see our section this color will be also change but our see only I not a text color but our section you can see our background color with uh, the text will be changed for uh, this logic will be not be good for that we can do uh, in the top top section uh, we have already created this background color we can do one thing here and just copy this all and uh, paste this uh, I think we can do only I want to remove just copy this all and we can give the paste this again for reducing and here I want to add uh, hover effect and here we can give this background color will be not be good we can give the you want to little bit light uh, just copy this all this and here paste this again and here just add uh, one more uh, after that uh, we add the hover and just make this all all this will be little bit light now here only I want to change uh, this one and here just uh, press the alt and click here everywhere and add a uh, hover ok now you can see ok now he hover is added and no need of this uh, remove this here here and now here
now let me check when I was uh, hover this uh, background color will be little bit change and this yellow will be not be change I want to I think I want to make a dark not a light yeah when I was out see this background color will be now change now this uh, top section will be completed now in the next video we make uh, this response you like this when I was reading uh, this flip W3 school see this now bar see this automatically no, uh, gone and for that we make a uh, this top section response you thank you for the watching till this and all this code you got in the description section you can check it thank you for the watching till this